A study, in clinical psychological science from 2014, spills the beans on why men often seem to enjoy boozing more than women do. Often only the thought of going to the pub can put a smile on a man's face. It turns out that when men share drinks, they also tend to share smiles, making it look like men are having a blast. This happens because of something called emotional contagion. It's like a hidden power that influences our feelings based on the emotions of those around us. If someone is genuinely happy and grinning, it's contagious, especially when it's a close friend or family member. Now, you've probably heard that alcohol is a great icebreaker in social gatherings. Scientists decided to test this idea. They brought together 720 social drinkers and split them into groups of three. Each person got either a vodka cranberry, a non-alcoholic drink, or a fake drink with a hint of vodka. These groups got acquainted and sipped their beverages at regular intervals. The researchers wanted to see how well these strangers would bond in this social experiment. They looked for real smiles, not those polite, camera-ready ones, and watched how fast these smiles spread from one person to another. The results were pretty interesting. When alcohol was in the mix, smiles spread more easily, but that was mostly in all guy groups. In mixed or all girl groups, alcohol didn't boost smile spreading any more than the non-alcoholic or fake drinks did. Weirdly enough, sober all girl groups had more contagious smiles than their male counterparts. It's like guys needed to up their alcohol game to reach the same social and friendly level as sober women. Here's the twist, many folks think that social drinking is harmless. But the lead author, Catherine Fairbairn, a PhD candidate at the University of Pittsburgh, has a warning. Excessive drinking in social settings often flies under the radar and doesn't set off as many alarms as habitual solo drinking does. But since guys appear to get their kicks from drinking with friends, that's where they might develop risky drinking habits. But don't forget to have fun and let your social life prosper. The art of moderation may well be the elusive path to maintaining the delicate equilibrium of revelry and camaraderie. Cheers to that! as Hunter S. Thompson might have put it. If you find this video interesting please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.